Let's continue playing Speedball 2 Brutal Deluxe. As you can see, our current position on the table is second. In an ideal world, this is where I'd like to finish, however... However... It takes a bit of manipulating the um, league to do it, yep. and I don't have the heart. Besides, we have to get revenge on Steel Fury. I said we're gonna get revenge on Steel Fury. No, you stupid goalkeeper. Right in, and there we go. Winger scores. Ten nothing. Get ready. Now this game we might use the multiplayer on, even though I've been trying. Damn super button. And goalkeeper dishes out wide. Along the side, two points. And we get some gold. Oh, come on. Oh. So it's, it becomes... No! Oh, that's good, the ball got away from us. And now we can move. Right, on we go. Stay away from the multipliers, stay away from the multipliers. Money. Go grab the other bit of money. Try to grab the other bit of money anyway. Come on. There's a stop button there. Didn't quite activate it. 14 points. Straight down the middle. Go. And Trevor scores another one, putting us 24 Get points to ready. 2 in the lead. Come on. Well, that was useful for you. Come on. Ah, couldn't quite break through. We will be buying players once we get to the um, to the top division. Oh, yeah, oh, that's fine. Annoyingly, they took my money. Not happy. And for that, 34 to 2. This is the team that gave us so many problems last time. The team we essentially capitulated against. Let's try ball. Yep, go, grab the ball, grab the ball, grab the ball. Yep. This is called killing the goalkeeper. But unfortunately, they spoiled my fun. And there we go. 44 to 2. Get ready. Spoiling my fun. You can have to use the electric ball at times, but you have to be a bit lucky, and it's easier to do it. Yeah. One of the players at the back, I think it's that one. The other defender is really close to being injured. Mind you, a few of my players are a bit, um, a bit close as well. Right, right centre mid, forward to left mid. Go. I think your throwing distance has been rapidly, massively improved. Yeah, you're nearly dead. But, 54 to 2, this is just going to be... Yeah, we're going to leapfrog them to the top of the league, almost certainly. I say almost certainly, because it's theoretically possible for the Renegades to have a massive, massive win. I don't think they can be tackled at the moment. Ah, good block! It's rare for me to do any f bit of goalkeeping skill. Replay. Case in point. Get ready. <sighs> okay, 54 points to 12 will have to do, but if I can get that player injured... Yeah, you're not having the ball. Ball can go up here. Match is over, 54 to 12. Brutal Jalux are the victors, and most likely from here, champions. Renegades managed a reasonable victory, but we are now ahead, and now we're up against the easiest team. Who's on the transfer table, actually, out of interest? Uh, a midfielder. A defender, but nobody we really want anymore. So, back to the gym. Now. Looking at the list a moment, fields are weak area, so we'll go all. And now we'll raise the attacks. And the defense. 
And then rather depressingly... Oh look, we couldn't do anything. Ah oh, dear. It, it always seems a waste to me to upgrade the subs, and it really is. But we need them to raise a few more points. Don't need many though. And then we can go up to 170. And then the problem begins all over again. Get ready. But our goalkeeper Barry and I think our centre forward Trevor are both now maxed out. So straight down the middle. Oops, I promised myself I wouldn't do that. Now this is going to be a case of how many points can I score in one game. Briefly, because actually looking at this I should still go for the money and stop sign. And thankfully the aggressive tendencies of my team mean that as I walk along like this, minding my own business, the rest of the team should attack. Ah, uh, you can't tackle me. Not that you could anyway, I imagine. And this is what you tend to do with um, the players you actually buy in the transfer market. You just take one of them and do this all day. Right, I think we got seven coins, so I don't think we can get any more money. So let's... I said I wasn't planning on using the multiplier, but now I'm just going to go score as many as I can in one game. To embarrass the weakest team in the league. Straight down the middle, 36 points. I reckon I can score 300 off this. Which will cause any number of Sparta references, I'm sure. Ah, dang it. That got slightly away from me. But we can sort of charge down the middle. And we're probably going to kill a few players by the time we're done here. Help you! Right, 60 to nil. Oh no, 62. So target is 300, it's possible. If I have to cheat off the bouncers, I can do it. There we go. Get ready. And already you can see the red bars looking decidedly low on my opposition side. That's 100. Get ready. Ah. So 200 points in one half, easily possible. That's why it's easily possible. Get ready. 32 to 2. In, we did score 32 points in 6 seconds. But they got the ball, pushed it wide. Back of the goalkeeper, straight in. We're going to manage two injuries in it now. Small amount of time, actually, because both their midfield and their goalkeeper look a bit battered. In fact, that's the first injury. And on come the uh, on come uh, on come the dog bots. Centre midfield injured and replaced by sub. One of the interesting things about this game: if you injure people more than um, if you injure more than three players, you still have the number of subs to count, count everything. Because otherwise this game wouldn't happen, and therefore they'd have to abandon it. But no, there's no abandoning a match of people. I don't know whether they put the old players back on, or whether they put, or whether they, the new players have the same sub stats, but... Ouch. That wasn't very nice, you know. For that, it's Electrified Ball. And the Electrified Ball causes an injury. And now they have a replacement goalkeeper. On the last side, it doesn't affect um, Revolver too much, because their characters are quite low stats anyway. There's another injury. So that's free. And I have scored 136 points in less than a quarter of the game. I said 300. That's looking easy at the moment. 244. Four. And the winger scores. Get ready. Right, well this is going to put the tournament out of reach. If we score 40 po championship points here, Nothing anybody can do can touch us. Get ready. 284 to 2. Bounce ball. Go in. Ah, excellent. I'm not quite sure the logist how that actually happened because it seems to be bouncing backwards before it went in, but I won't Get complain. Ready. 316 to 2. Oh, 
I almost feel sorry for them. I'll be honest. I almost feel sorry for them. Get ready. And that did it again. 368. If I were to use the um, bounce, if I were to abuse the bouncing ball in the middle, I'd already be up to about 500 by now because they cannot tackle me, at least not of any degree of accuracy or success. Anyway, no, oh, you. Of course, they like to prove me wrong, and for that, that guy suffered a bit of a punishment. Six seconds. I won't go for another goal, but I will try and complete the star bonus on the left. Should be possible, as long as I get the ball. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 416 to 2. We earned 51 championship points, and I think we had about 100 before we began. Yep. Right, we now have a 45 point lead in the, title, in the table, and we're out of reach. Barracu are next. They'll put up a bit more of a threat, but not much. We're going to ignore the transfer window entirely and just go upgrade the subs. Right, now that we can go up to 170 in all stats, let's go upgrade Barry. Our centre midfielder, Graham, who actually wasn't a full. Let's fix that. And Trevor. Right, so our team now is 161, 160, 159. We're nicely set up, I feel. And of course, we now have a centre line which is maxed out, or at least as maxed out as we can be at this point in the game. Which means we can pretty much do the centre line trick all day long here. But we are going to go and grab some gold. Since 550 appears to be the limit of what it will give us, I thought it was more than that. It is in the cup games. Oh, you. Yeah. Yeah, Barracu can probably tackle us a bit. Ah! As you can see now, we are visibly faster. We are visibly stronger. And we do a lot more damage when we tackle them. 10 0. And I see the gold I'm going for now. I'm not going to go for ridiculous scores anymore. We did that once. We'll hit the tackle button, but it didn't affect you. We will be still going for the wins. We're going for the money. But I won't be using the score multiplier to go ridiculous anymore. I've had my fun. Besides which, the game will punish me when I face Super Nash on the first match of the um, first division. And then they will thrash me by 200 points. Straight down the middle, goal. 20 to nothing. Get ready. And this is the point of the game where everything seems too easy. But for as easy as it is now, it won't be for much longer. All it takes is Super Nash one scoring 200 points against you to in the first match, and then you will know that the game is really hard, <laughs> quite difficult. Or at least it can, it will can seem like that way. It won't take you long, similar to this um, league, really. Ah. Come on. I know I said I'm not going for big scores, but I do want to actually win by a, a margin, as opposed to two goals. There we go. Get ready. Uh, tackle, and straight in. And the throw goes down. I thought I might have managed that straight in, but of course my throwing skill is better than it used to be. I'll have to rework that one out. Oop, there. Goes for centre forward, which means he goes backwards. Strong 
great there. Man. 54 to nothing. Barrack you, you are destroyed. Though, thankfully, not as much as Revolver. And let's see if we can cause some more injuries. Which would be fun. Ah. But it's all part of the game. We get points for it. They didn't want to get injured. They should be spending all that money they pick up. Sixty-four to nothing. Twenty-eight get seconds ready. left. I think I can get this up to around hundred. Though not if the ball's going that way. <laughs> that was quite a cool little coming together there. Yeah, but the goalkeeper is about to fall, so that's good. We can get ten points off him, possibly scoring in the same moment. 82. Oh, that went straight in. I love those bouncer shots. Right, let's kill the goalkeeper. Or the centre forward. Centre forward will do. Yeah, trying to use the multiplier, are you? Ah, fine. 92 to 0. Brutal Deluxe have won another game. Steel Fury, 91 points victory for themselves. But they're already far too far behind. Far too far behind. Just having a brief look at the top table, because that determines who we might be facing. Of course, if Steel Fury can win the playoffs, but it's not guaranteed. But it is very useful to have. Hmm. Let's actually raise the subs. Right, now we can go to 180. And I think... Once I have... Let's the attack up. Let's just finish that off as well. In fact... Nope. My defence boost. I think, once we have everybody at 200... See, the attack's now at 170. Once I get midfield and defence to 170, I might stop... putting money into the... Um, upgrades and start saving up for the um, Division 1 uh, transfer market. I've got four games left, so that's 2,000 and a bit gold. So if I have a 1,000 going into the next league, plus the value of my players are already quite high, but I will be trying to use the subs for that. Yeah, I think this would work quite nicely. No, oh, you use the tackle button, you evil gits. Oh, chaos button. Thankfully, I managed to stop myself scoring. Ah, money. No excuse for not picking up the money at the moment. Ah. out of the edge of control, I was out of nab that. Okay, you want a score multiplier? I'll let you have a score multiplier. It won't do you any good. I guarantee you now, you will not win with a score multiplier. Because this is going to happen. You may well be the third best team in the division, but you're no match for me. So I can do this. I could do that as well. 14 to nothing. Get ready. And I can probably keep the running goes down to nothing actually the way we're going. Now. Yeah. Come on. Oh, you stole my money. I'm not happy with that. Anyway, 40 to nothing. Don't need a massive win, as I've said. Just need to win. 10 points a match, Steel Fury will not get 200 point victories, which is what they need at this stage. Nash won? I might have needed to, um, to go extreme with this and use the po points multiplier and just every easy game in Division 1 you need to start scoring 200 points. That's exactly what Nash won and Fatal Justice do. Get ready. And the 
another another goal there, 60 to nothing. We're just taking them apart, really. This is just a casual day at the office for us. Oh, duh, can't be tackled. But now they can. And now we can't be tackled. I was hoping to get the goal out of that. But there's the goal we wanted. 17 nothing. Get ready. Third best team? I'd say fourth at best. Well, unfortunately we just now blemished our score slightly because we had only, I think, scored for goals so far this game. Still, 82 points to nothing. Can't complain. Grab that back. Do we kill the goalkeeper? Not quite. He's close though. You can't be tackled. Grab the ball, grab the ball, grab the ball. Ah, he's still not dead. I'm surprised at that. I thought I just got him. Alright, Brutal Gilux win. And that means we are now at round 11 games played. Massive lead. We are going to win. Broma Sires next. I bet they're looking forward to it. So, if we raise our defence... So that means our defence is actually 171, but that's fair, that's fair enough. Midfield. Okay. So we're now going to save every bit of money from now on, although what I will do at least is um, make the midfield a bit more aggressive. So it's 171, 171, 170. Okay. So what I shall do is I shall stop the video here. Next video we'll complete League 2 and probably make our first match in League 1, which will be an experience depending on who we're up against. But we will now no longer spend... Oops. Spend money upgrading players. Importantly, each of the subs is worth 460. Which may become relevant. We want to buy a certain goalkeeper. He will shall replace Barry, but Barry will then move up to um, one of the wings. There's also a good midfielder we'll get, and that will just replace our front line. These players will still be rain. Yeah. <sighs> Well, I think I'm going to stop the video here. Okay, until next time.